Hey folks, this is Jake Davis with an on-the-fly review for you. And today I'm talking about Judas and the Black Messiah, released last uh, released from 2020, uh, directed by Shaka Khan, uh, Shaka King, <laughs> and uh, starring uh, Lakeith Stanfield, Daniel Kaluuya, uh, Jesse Plemons, uh, Lil Rel Howery, and Martin Sheen. Uh, this movie is nominated for several Academy Awards, including Best Picture of the Year. The uh, whole deal with this film is it's the story of Bill O'Neill, who was the uh, FBI informant uh, inside of the Black Panthers in the 1960s, and most importantly, the man who sold out Fred Hampton and got him killed. The uh, And this movie is basically about basically the story of his, uh, his conflict, his confliction, his guilt, uh, uh, his, uh, his rise in the Black Panthers, how he got worked into the FBI, and of course, most importantly, his friendship with Fred himself. Uh, I mean, I thought this was a good movie. Lakeith Stanfield is the lead role, should be nominated for Best Actor. What the fuck, Oscars? Uh, but this was, uh, I, my, my real problem was just, I, I'd seen it. I really felt I just, everything about this I'd seen before, I had a real Irishman vibe. Like, it felt basically like, in a lot of ways, it was the exact same movie as the Scorsese film from last year. Um, with just different historical figures. The, uh, Kaluuya, mag I mean, just in, in, uh, mag uh, magnetic in this. He was very, very good in this. And, uh, Stanfield's terrific, too, but he just should be nominated for lead. Uh, Jesse Plemons is chilling anyway. So he's got those empty, soulless, fucking emotionless eyes. Just scary, scary goddamn cracker. And now, uh, I mean, I, I, I do definitely prefer a film like this over films like, uh, uh, you know, say The Help or Ghosts of Mississippi that are more about the white folks. Uh, but I don't think this was as good as other civil rights films of recent times, such as, you know, Selma, or even movies from the 90s like Malcolm X. Uh, and it definitely wasn't as explosive as, say, uh, uh, Black Klansman was. The, uh... Um... Something else I wanted to say. I wanted to make another point or two. What's up, baby? You wake up? Come here. Ah. Uh, I kind of felt the action scenes uh, could have been directed better, definitely. Uh, just kind of felt like boring, generic action movies, sequences, uh, shoot em, sh uh, gun fights. Uh... And damn it, there's something I wanted to say. Darn it. You made me forget. I hope you're happy. Anyhow, you know, look at I just... Happy. As much as I liked it, like I said, I felt like, ow. It was uh, treading old territory. Uh, and, uh... Yeah, it's just, uh, I couldn't really give any more than three and a half stars, even though it's, it's a decent movie. Uh, anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this video. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. I'm Jake Davis, and I'll catch you on the fly.